Hello everyone, welcome to Matt's Top Tech. Today we're taking a look at the NFC blocker for your credit and debit cards with contactless payment just to see if they do actually manage to block the signals that are given out from your contactless credit and debit cards. So we've got the RISE NFC RFID blocker. These are really cheap, they retail for around five, six, seven pounds, something like that. They're, uh, they're very cheap. I'll leave a link in the description below to uh, Amazon so you can check out the prices for yourself. It's the same size as a credit or debit card, maybe a, a touch wider, uh, but it should fit in your wallet, your purse, wherever, perfectly. The range is about 2.5 centimeters, so it's not massive. It'll just cover your your wallet. If you put it in there between your cards, basically it absorbs the signals that your cards give off. It also works with mobile phones, so if you use your mobile phone to pay for things, it'll also absorb that signal and not allow that to work. We went to try it out. We went to the local shop. Um, we used it to try and pay for some stuff and it, it actually worked. It, it throws an error message up on the machine. Um, some of the other places we've tried it, it, it either throws an error message up or it just doesn't see the card at all. So it definitely works and for the price, it's, it's a no-brainer just to have that added security. Stick it in your wallet, you won't even know it's there. The banks will have you believe that you know, these contactless cards, there's no way that people can get your details off there, blah de blah. But if you read some of the research online, it's you know, some companies have proven that, you know, the they can actually get your details off the card just from this um signal that's given off from the card. So whatever you believe, for the sake of a few pound, I think it's definitely a good buy just to keep in your wallet. There were a good video on YouTube as well where a lot of these contactless card machines are portable now and they're not attached to any wires and the guy with this machine runs up to somebody, touches it near his back pocket where his wallet is and it actually accepts the payment through his trousers and through his wallet. So it's, uh, it's definitely worth having one of these in your wallet or in your purse. We definitely recommend it just to give you that extra peace of mind. So, as always guys, thanks for watching. I hope you found this useful. Let us know in the description what you think, if you think your cards have been stolen before or if you've had any problems with the NFC signals on them. Let us know and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.